I mounted that Taurus one on this 351, but I forgot to bring my deflector along. <laughs> so I shot five times and I found one piece of brass. So I'm not going to shoot that again, but I'll splice in that footage here. See? Five. The whole five. But after I did that, you know, I've been playing around swapping stuff back and forth. I had this this Lyman sight on that, and I really liked the way it fit. But the problem was, it was too high for that action. But it fit on there beautifully. So, I think I'm going to order in another Lyman and modify it to drop it down about an eighth of an inch, and then I'd be in pretty good shape. But I mounted this Lyman one on the Cowboy. And I really didn't follow their directions. <laughs> you know, they want you to, you know, they, it comes with a little plate. So you drill a hole right in front of this other hole, then put that dummy plate on, then put a screw. It's all to get around your serial number. Well, I'm not worried. My serial number is way up here. You know, they didn't put them on the tag on these. So I've got this one lined up perfectly. It will, like, like right now, when I look through it, I can see my diamond on my buckhorn sight is lined up right with the bead. It's just ideal. And that's at a very low setting. Now, if I crank this up, it'll go up above what my maximum height is on this sight. You know, they always, the theory is you put one of these on and get rid of your sights. I don't want to do that. This is an auxiliary sight. This is to get that extra range in there, you know, to get over the, you know, like four and a quarter, four and a half. Then I can use this one. This will get me to five. Uh, it actually works very well. But there'll be a lot of experimenting. Now these loads are my my trail boss loads, but it's a case full of trail boss, so they're no joke, but I don't like to shoot my my full power loads at the gong because they almost go through that half inch steel. But I like the sight. You know what, I like that I'm not married to the thing. I can dump it down. I'm back to my regular sights. But I know somebody had made a comment, don't, don't drill, don't drill. You know, it isn't that I'm so bothered by drilling. I just didn't like drilling there. But it mounted in there just perfectly. Uh, if you can see it, but that's the way it's supposed to be That works very well But that that damn plate they wanted you to put in here uh, You know cuz then what happens you've got That the dummy plate in between So you've got so much chance of being off You know just look like a flimsy mount this way. It's solid really good that worked out perfectly. But like I say, I'll probably get a, a Lyman one to adopt to fit on here. Well, it'll fit on it just to get the height down. But it is just a set screw that holds this in. I could pull this whole tower, run this down about an eighth of an inch, cut a little off the bottom of that stem, and I think I'll be in business.